Thank you, Jensen. Thanks for having us. You know, we're excited to announce the latest chapter of our partnership. I know we've worked together since 2019, building solutions that combine the NVIDIA DGX base pod with our technology, multiple super pod architectures, and of course, the NVIDIA cloud program designs. But more importantly, super excited about the fact that we've served hundreds of customers around the world, bringing them real value. Yeah, today is such a big day. It's a huge day because we're announcing a revolutionary product at a revolutionary time. Exactly. You know, this is, um, uh, and we've been working together now for so long. DGX1 was the world's first AI supercomputer. That's exactly And it was connected to NetApp. Net That's right. And we use NetApp all over our company. I love the fact that you are multi-cloud and you're a hybrid cloud. With one basic platform, you could manage your storage, you can manage all of your company's data from structure to object to files, multimedia, multimodal data now. That's right. That's right? Exactly Today, right. Today's world is complicated. That's exactly right. Insanely complicated. And the vast majority of, of our data is actually multimedia and multimodal. And so that's got to be 90% of NVIDIA's data is unstructured. And, and, uh, and now with, and with NetApp, uh, we can manage that coherently you know, on, across all of the clouds and, and, uh, and hybrid cloud. Uh, and, the, and the thing that's really, really exciting is that uh, today we're announcing a dream come true for both of us. You know, we reinvented computing. Accelerated computing, reinvented computing, AI reinvented computing. Every layer of the computing stack has been reinvented from the chips to the systems, the software, the model, the applications on top. And now we've entered into the world of agentic AI. But those agents learn from data That's exactly and they right. operate on data. Isn't that right? Exactly. So they learn from data and they operate on data. And the most important thing is data. It's the food of AI. That's exactly right. <laughs> okay. It's the food of AI. And so, so it's the food of these agents. That's what the agents eat. <laughs> That's exactly right. <laughs> what we're announcing today, bringing our two companies' technologies together, is exactly that. How do you bring accelerated computing technologies and your software stack for AI data platform? Together with NetApp Technologies, we're announcing the NetApp AFX family, which combines a highly scaled, extreme performance, composable, disaggregated storage architecture that can bring near data compute together with exabyte scale data pools, hundreds of petabyte scale namespaces so that you can bring performance and precision to data scientists while giving IT teams a familiar set of technologies that they can scale efficiently. Mm -hmm. And we are also bringing together the NVIDIA AI data platform technologies together with a suite of technologies from NetApp software capabilities called the NetApp AI data engine that can make AI simple, affordable, easy. We can make it much easier for companies like yourselves to discover their data, to catalog it, to be able to implement guardrails, and to transform and enrich and serve that data efficiently to the LLMs and the accelerated computing architectures that you guys are so famous for. So we're really excited. It's groundbreaking. It allows us to bring our mission of helping our clients get knowledge from the vast amount of data that we store for them. Well, this is exciting because AFX and the AI data engine is a complete reinvention of data processing as we know it. Just as we reinvented computing, we're now going to reinvent data processing. Now, the thing that's really incredible is in the old days, I guess we still do it now, a lot of uh, enterprise what we believe to be enterprise knowledge is uh, embedded into uh, structured data. That's correct. And um, and the way you index structured data, uh, the way you query structured data uh, using SQL, for example, uh, fundamentally different than the way we do uh, data processing and, and uh, data storage in the future. Semantic, AI semantic AI, uh, data processing includes embedding, which is discovering the meaning of the data, uh, indexing and indexing is not, 
you know, it's not uh, not uh, hash tables. That's right. You know, That's it's exactly. not trees and graphs. Uh, indexing now is a neural network that uh, indexes a, a nearest neighbors. The technology is fundamentally meant fundamentally different. It's vectorized. And so it's a vectorized database, and you have to index it in a vectorized way. And the way we search it and query that engine is a is an AI query. And we're, we've done we've done so now in a way that allows us to do it in a multimodal way. So whether it's video or audio or text or PDF file, which is you know that's exactly I think the vast majority of the Nvidia's knowledge is in PDF. And so all all of these different modalities. Um, and for if you're a drug discovery company, maybe it's chemicals and and proteins, um, you know, maybe uh, health records. It's all in different different types of data structures, and uh, and different modalities. And and now we have an AI processing engine that allows us to uh, embed the knowledge and query it based on the knowledge uh, that you're looking for, the insight that you're looking for. That entire platform we've been working on together for That's some correct. time, and I'm just incredibly excited that. This new way of connecting your company's knowledge base to these AI in AI agents are now possible. This is a big day. Yeah, we're super excited. You know, it has been a long-term dream for us to be able to help our clients to extract the knowledge that exists in their data. We've often talked about unified data storage. Mm -hmm. Now what we are able to do, exactly as you said, through a semantic representation of the data, talk about a unified data model. And to do so without all of the constraints of centralized processing. You know, our AI data engines will be available in a software model that can run on any NVIDIA GPU anywhere in the world, including your RTX Pro servers with Blackwell. This entire software-defined platform of yours either runs on-prem, you have an appliance that you can offer to customers, right. you can run on any OEM servers, you can run in any cloud, because NVIDIA's GPU is right. in every cloud. You support all the different versions of our GPUs. That's right. It's incredible. Thanks. And so now AI, AI, you know, AIs could talk to their data that's exactly. You know, what's really amazing is just that search has been revolutionized. We used to do search. Today, we just ask the internet a That's question. That's exactly right. That's and exactly. In, the few, in the past, we'll find our files, pull our files out of storage, process it somehow. In the future, you just ask the AI, ask NetApp exactly. some question, ask it. The question could be as comprehensive. The prompt could be as deep as you like it to be That's exactly with right. lots and lots of research that it has to go and do. And NetApp will just go into the storage system and find you the answer. We actually believe that the world of storage and data will transform from classic protocol-driven data operations to agentic data operations mm -hmm. where our agents, just like you said, Jensen, will be able to have a semantic understanding of the data across the hybrid cloud, wherever your data exists, and we'll be able to retrieve the data that you are looking for through any framework to access it, whether it's natural language search or conversational you know, access to data. And it makes it so much easier for our combined clients to be able to get value from their data. An additional capability that we're excited about and our clients are, you know, super uh, excited about is really how do you preserve all of your security, your guardrails, the ability to track data changes, the ability to track the lineage of data so that they can make sure that their models are using high quality data and that they can be efficient in their pipelines. And so, again, our two technologies working together helps our clients be able to extract value from their data, but keep it compliant with all of the risk management policies and security policies in their enterprise. In fact, you were telling me we do that here. That's right. Isn't that right? That's exactly right. So, you know, right. we we process a mountain of data here because we're training AI models. And and um, uh, you, you you now need AI to uh, also find the information uh, that is uh, semantically similar That's to exactly right. other other data that maybe we would like to train an AI model with. 
And and so uh, how each one of these um, uh, store, uh, objects are embedded uh, depends on the on the AI model that embedded it. And so we need to track that and make sure that it's consistent over time. And uh, using your tools, using your file, file system, uh, we were able to tell uh, which ones have already been embedded properly, which ones are uh, out of date, uh, which ones are uh, using a different embedding system. That's exactly so that, right. that's, that tracking, that genealogy is really, really important to us. Thank you. This is so great, George. This You and I, we start, our company started about that's the same right. time. This is the first major reinvention of the storage system. That's right. For 30, since 33 years ago that NetApp was founded. That's right. This is a very, very big deal. Now for us, this is a huge deal because for the very first time, NVIDIA GPUs will find its way into file systems and storage systems all over the world. For the very first time, that's an opportunity for us. That's exactly. So this is a great growth opportunity for both of us. Yeah, we're super excited. You know, we've worked on this for a long time and our, you know, composable disaggregated architecture brings together near data compute with your accelerated computing capabilities and a zero copy way of transforming and enriching data and active metadata. Doing the processing right in the storage. Correct. Yeah, it's really incredible. Instead of pulling the data out, that's exactly do right. processing. You know, this is the way kind of a lot of companies do it today and we do it too. We have multiple copies of the same data. That's right. Now in the world of AI, the data is huge. It's video data. You know, maybe it's a uh, uh, physical world data, uh, and and uh, in order to process it, we have to bring it out of the storage and do processing wherever the systems are. Today, was in the future, we'll just do it right inside an app. Absolutely, and you know, we're already seeing examples of this in large clients around the world. You know, you look at the Johnson and Johnson; they are trying to accelerate drug discovery and they have their data spread across a hybrid data set. And together, we're helping them build this, you know, accelerated computing and data fabric that combines on-premises environments, multiple of those with cloud environments so that they can get one seamless topology of data. We're doing the same thing with uh, Yale School of Medicine where they're trying to combine different types and modalities of data research data with clinical data as part of their computational health platform that, again, combines our technology so that they can accelerate oncological research. Mm -hmm. So super excited. You know, we're delivering real value already to clients. This set of technologies and capabilities exponentially expands those opportunities for our clients. AI is reinventing computing as we know it. And then today, we're reinventing storage That's right. AI for the very first time. And this is such a big deal. I'm, I'm excited that it's reinventing both of our companies. Thank you. And it's, it's uh, as you know, uh, this is the biggest industrial revolution the world's ever seen. Uh, this is complete reset of the computer industry. And it's created a huge opportunity for me. Um, I think it's going to create a huge opportunity for you. And this partnership has been a great joy for me. Thank you so much. Thanks for having us. Our clients will be excited to see much more co-innovation from us going forward. Thank Terrific. you, Jensen. Congratulations on the launch. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you very much.